and the first will be uh, of course theoretical part and uh, we need to understand how to paint water without uh, motion and um, how to paint it in realism and uh, at the first you can see that the area perspective you can find in all cityscape landscape yes. when you can see the gradient of the tone when the dark tone will be near of us and uh, the light tone will be on the background and the distance if we make the area perspective really great then you can see that uh, your work uh, give more deeper than than before than other different type and of course when we paint water we also need to know this moment I make at the first it will be a sketch and the next one it will be sketch in color by the way if you want to move on with painting water and its reflections we have really great news for you you can join our online course the city and water it will help you to understand the structure and shape of water and learn how to paint water and make it dynamic and deep what else is waiting for you during the course? You will learn how to apply the linear and aerial perspective, learn how to paint water with and without waves, make reflections. You will learn how to simplify architecture, combine the parts of the cityscape and remove unnecessary details. At the end of the course, you will create four atmospheric paintings on your own. So if you are a beginner and you have a strong desire to learn Welcome to our course via active link in the right upper corner of this video. Just click on it and see what we have for you. Feel free to register and start learning right now. The link is also in the description below this video. Hope to see you soon. If our weather is good and uh, the water is calm, we can see only this situation. that. It's really great if uh, you make some, th some sketch with me uh, in uh, your book um, because uh, it's better to, to understand how your um, hand work with your um, mind and every time to repeat the same motion with the hand. So... Uh, their uh, darkest of tone depend of their uh, your your pencil. This is HB. Uh, it may be 2B or 9B. 9B give you more graphite, and uh, here is more dark. But if we have a uh, calm water, it will be look like this. Only dark here, dark tone. And more light tone here. Yes. It's only gradient like this. For example, like uh, in our first lesson, we can see this situation. Yes, here is you understand. If you don't see it, you can use uh, the the sheet of paper and see this um, different, different between uh, the color and the tone uh, of the white sheet of paper and all the point uh, on uh, your reference. And of course here you can see that more darker and it's a calm water. But of course it's not every time. 
sometimes the wind happened and we can see the more waves on our water. And here is some secret. At the first, uh, every time the beginner starts to paint all waves, all waves, all small waves here, a lot of waves, but not. It's not realistic when we uh, paint all, all, all waves uh, on <laughs> all your work, yes, because you need to uh, save this uh, graduation also on the waves. For example, this, the first, and the second, and the third, and the fourth step. Yes, here is only calm water without any waves. And the second one, we can see some small some small and really long, like, line. Waves. Because uh, the waves look like this, you can find only near of us, not on the distance. On the distance we can see only long, long, long. <laughs> uh, because uh, it will be more calmer. And uh, the air perspective uh, will be also here. Yes. And after that, the tone of these waves will be short. Yes. Only one tone darker than the place which it is. The next one is the sword. We can see more, bigger, bigger and darker waves. I can use maybe pencil. Maybe 2B pencil. To paint it. Yes, bigger and darker. And uh, the form of the waves look like uh, these waves. Yes, look like Something like this. And these waves, yes, more like this, like I. Like but not, never, never, the waves never look like this. Yes, not. Uh, because uh, if you can see uh, on the mm, front of the waves and on the left side, for example, you can see this. And under the waves will be shadow, shadow and reflection inside of the water. Yes, that's why we can see something like this. Yes, it's a edge, it's the surface of the water. And uh, this is waves and this is a shadow of waves. So, that's why we can see this form and shape of waves will be uh, not like this, yes, like this. And bigger and darker. That's why it's a four and bigger than this. And after that, of course, it's uh, normal to uh, graduate it uh, more um, nature, uh, not only put it bigger and bigger this, no, uh, and some small points uh, you can have here, but not the big you can have here. And of course, near of us, we can find much more big waves. And the most dark points of the wave will be here. This one. That's why we can see that uh, this work with your pencil is really deep, because we see the surface of the water, and uh, under the under the surface, we, we, we can see a lot of waves, different types, different uh, uh, tone, and uh, 
it's we believe in it <laughs> so i will show you this step uh, on uh, on this paper with the paint of course but um, also about shape uh, Every time I listen the questions and how to paint it, because sometimes we, we try to paint like a chairs, yes, <laughs> and here and here not. Uh, I try to use this motion of the hand every time like uh, this line. Yes, but sometimes I put my hand inside of the, of the paper, but sometimes I up my hand. That's why I find this line and add the, the waves like this. And you can see that it's more natural with the uh, v, v form, v form of the light tone here. But of course you understand it every time when I repeat it on the rock. But it's first time when we uh, know how to do it and uh, then uh, I repeat it in practice. Okay. We need to wet our paper. Uh, this is a cellulose paper, that's why I don't worry about effects or something, uh, beautiful points, but we need to understand the principle of this work, yeah. the rules. Uh, for explanation, uh, I will use only one color, it will be lunar blue from Daniel Smith. Because uh, it has a uh, great granulation and uh, I like this color. Yes. I make uh, the granulation, uh, gra graduation of the tone from uh, this side to this side. Uh, it's better to start on the <laughs> uh, bottom. Of the uh, of the your paper because uh, you take a lot of color uh, to your brush and of course when you up uh, you give it to the surface yes that's why it's easy yes. You can see it's calm water. Calm water. If we haven't a wind, we can save it's like this. It's water, yes, yes. <laughs> After that, I use more synthetic brush and uh, smaller and start to add some small, small and more light without a lot of paint. Here, small line. Yes. I try, you can see on my hand, yes, I try to make not the motion like uh, with a pen or the pencil, yes, we don't at the school. We try to use your brush in different way. After that I give more More being a, yes. I try to save this V, yes. And here is more. Of course, the water is really different, but if you know this way, how to paint, you can paint it from your mind. You don't see <laughs> the water in reality. But of course, uh, when you find the uh, 
uh, Atlantic Sea or maybe you can see um, more cold water in the Russian Sea and maybe um, other. Uh, the, the colors of the water really different and their types of the wave also but yes i i can add some small point between of the big wave and in there near or fast i save something big and please don't stop on the uh edge of their um of the paper uh, you need to to go out yes because because uh, this way uh, this wave don't stop <laughs> yes let's go out every time don't stop here it's like example but uh, of course we will see it uh, on the work yes uh, you can see and uh, now we understand how to paint water uh, when it's calm, when it have uh, some small waves and how it's pain from our mind. We need to save a, a graduation of the tone from the light tone to the dark tone here, also from the light tone of the waves to the dark tone of the waves, from the small size of the waves to the big size of the waves and also save its uh, shape. 